Next is an entrepreneur with a strong food business pedigree who's looking to get his product into every Australian kitchen. Looking forward to the next one, two, three or five years to see this baby grow. Hi Sharks, my name is Benjamin Sear and I'm the founder of Hummingbird. Today I'm seeking $200,000 for a 10% stake in Hummingbird. I founded Hummingbird because I'm definitely part of those 56% of people who rather stay in bed those 10 minutes than to prepare a proper breakfast. So I thought I want to solve this problem by offering a healthy and convenient way to enjoy breakfast every day. And the solution to this is Blendies. Blendies are superfood balls. You simply drop into a blender, add food and water to get your supercharged breakfast smoothie in absolutely no time. And the best part is, for only $9.90 per week, we deliver Blendies straight to your doorstep, free of any delivery charge. So forget your Nana's jam on toast and forget your mum's bowl of cornflakes. Blendies is a solution for your breakfast needs. Okay. Who of you would like to give it a go out here? Oh, yeah. Oh. Give it a crack. Okay. So, Benjamin, that's 200,000. Exactly. 10%. So, you're valuing your business at a cool $2 million. Correct. Okay. What's that accent we're hearing? I'm half German, half Australian. Right. Grew up in Germany. Benjamin, what are we doing? You're going to do it. All you no. need to do okay. is drop the banana into the blender. There we go. The uh, nutritious looking protein ball. Exactly. And the uh, almond milk. I'm thinking you've got a new casual going to work in one of your local stores. I yeah. wouldn't have him. No, I wouldn't have him. <laughs> He's going, why would I put a banana in it for? <laughs> Might be healthy. OK, you need to drink that, Steve. Oh, no, I just realised that. <laughs> <laughs> This is the most nutritious meal he's had in That's about right. six weeks. It won't kill you, Steve. It's going to be OK. You'll live forever after <laughs> He might actually really like it. Cheers. Cheers. I think it's beer. All right. Well, tastes that pretty good. Sound, that doesn't sound... <laughs> no, uh, trust like... me, that's a good response for Steve. Which yeah. one? What, what was flavour was mine? Uh, you have the antiox blendy. All right. Oh, this one, I see. One? And that one was the protein one, which yeah. Janine has. Tastes fabulous. It's good. It's not bad. I, I, I've just had the cleanser. Yeah, I gave you the green one. That tastes great. I really like it. Yeah. So uh, what, what brought you to this? After graduating from university, I um, was in the founding team of um, what you now know as Fedora. Yeah. Wow. Um, that was back in Munich in Germany. So Benjamin, sorry, just explain to me what Fedora is. OK. Fedora is a, a delivery service for restaurants that ordinarily wouldn't deliver. OK. I was in charge of um, opening up the western cities of Germany, and then I came here to open up Melbourne and Brisbane. What do you cost to, to produce? Um, the tube cost me $4.50, including the balls, obviously. OK, yep. Um, and we sell it in a single, if you only order it in a single um, order, it's $15.90. However, if you choose a subscription, it gets it gets cheaper. Down, down to 10 bucks, 9 dollars you were saying. Exactly. Yeah. I want to understand what you got here. Tell me where you guys are at right now. What are your sales? What, what's the profit? We're what's... only selling online. We went live about three months ago, and since we've sold um, $40,000 worth of uh, blendies. So in three months, you've done $40,000 in sales. Yep. That's extraordinary. Three um, months, $40,000 is extraordinary. So you are 100% owner in, in... No, I'm not. Oh. I have two co-founders. Yes. Um, and then we have um, one investor and we gave the manufacturing company to 10%. Right. And you own the majority? The three founders own 55%. And so how much do you own? 10%. So you said you had this idea. You're now a 10% shareholder. There's a whole bunch of other people. I'm sitting here going, what happened? We actually started right from the start with that shareholder structure. Um, the reason was um, we wanted to grow this fast right from the start. And since I don't have half a million on my bank account... So what was the original startup capital? 
Uh, 420,000. 420,000. Yeah. Uh, who contributed that, please? Um, one of the founders, yep. who has 37%, okay, yep. it's the higher share, and one investor. You didn't pay for your equity. I didn't pay for my so equity. So you got what sweat. we call sweat equity because you've got exactly. the experience, a track record. Correct. And you said, I'll put the deal together and run it for you, but you guys put the money in. Correct. Okay, now I get it. You're valuing your business at two million bucks. That's a lot of money. It you've is. got a complicated shareholding, which I'm not liking, but I'm liking you. At 25, you've done an, you've already got two businesses off the ground, so well done. Convince me that if I give you $200,000, I'm going to see any money back. If I just take the calendar year 2017, um, the sales will be roughly 950,000. Um, is, is that calendar 17? Yeah, right? calendar 17. And in 2018, we want to be at 1.7 million. Hey, uh, Benjamin, I'm going to let you know where I'm at. I, I, I think this is a, uh, another in a long line of fads, to be honest. I'm not a natural consumer of it. I'm not a believer in it, to be honest. So I, I'm quite, uh, I've quite enjoyed hearing your story, but I'll, I'll let you concentrate now the four and I'll bow you up. Right. Thanks very much, Thank you. mate. Yeah, I like your business, but I am struggling with... Uh, there's more dilution coming. Cash burn's going to continue, and, and I really, I really detest cash burn. So unfortunately, Benjamin, I'll be a customer, but I won't be an investor today. All right. Thank you. I'm out. I think the product's great. It tastes good. But I feel like I've been invited too late to the party. Oh, sorry uh, about that. I don't like your valuation. <laughs> so I wish you luck, okay. but I'm out. Thank you. Obviously, you know I know this space very well and live and breathe it every day. And diehards like me really understand what they need. So, and the needs of everyone in my family are very different. So I worry that it's a bit generic and that people will go, it's a good idea, but then can't be bothered to do it in the future. Thank God, because then they come to us. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't know, maybe they can afford to come to you every time. I do see it as a mass customer product, just because people want to live healthier. We have five different functionalities, and um, obviously there will be new products in the future. Your valuation is, um, is pretty high for a business that has no track record, uh, no evidence that it's actually going to even succeed, and you have not valued in any execution risk. I'm out. All right, thank you. Benjamin, what are we going to do with you? You know what? I'm going to make you an offer. What? I'm going to invest in you. I actually think if it's not this, it'll be something else. So the only way I can get anywhere near the number is to split it, meaning some equity and some loan. The offer is $100,000 for 10%, because I don't want to see you diluted any more than you were prepared to go in, and a $100,000 loan. Um, can I have a quick timeout? Sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah, OK. The cost of launching this brand in the US will be huge. Hi, how are you going? Come on, Benji. Talk to us. So, Benjamin, big decision to make. Naomi's offered you $100,000 for 10% plus a $100,000 loan. Yes. Um, I had a chat to my two co-founders. We've decided that we can't take um, 100,000 for 10 percent because um, our current investors would be willing to invest at a higher valuation. Um, the only counter offer I can make is 7 percent. So, Benjamin, I would be a great fan, but I'm not going to be an investor today. Okay. I wish you all the best. I do know the value that I bring to businesses, but unfortunately, this is not going to be one for me. All right. Good luck. Have Thanks fun. So. I'll be Thank a you. great fan. It. Thanks, Thank you. Bye. Right, Thank Thank you. Take care. You. Thank you. All right, Ben, you dodged the bullet. <laughs> With friends like him, who needs enemies? That's what I say.